I'm telling you, bro, I think you might have just figured out what Tucker Carlson's next move might be. And yeah. it's definitely Tucker Carlson's farm. <laughs> now he's talking about doing a debate. So, you know, you know, the crazy thing about Tucker is that, you know, there's there's got to be some kind of a non-compete in that in that contract or they're probably going to try and. I, I can see them trying to sideline him for 24, but I, I, I don't think know. it depends on what he's getting paid out. If he's still if they if they if they decide to walk away, because I'm curious to see and we don't know this yet, whether or not he and Fox mutually said we'll walk away because he yeah. was getting paid not a small amount of money. But when you look at what a Joe Rogan got paid to go to Spotify and I know Elon Musk is saying come to Twitter, Elon Musk may go, look, I'll make a deal with for one hundred fifty million dollars tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. And this is your platform. So, I mean. Tucker may have made this the best move just by saying, look, you want to fire me? Fine. I'll walk away, but I'm not signing anything. Yeah. We're just done here. Oh, I think Don't so. You have to pay me, but we're done. I, no. was talking, I interviewed Kyle Becker uh, the other day, and we were talking about this, about how has the 24-hour cable news platform kind of outlived its usefulness? And do people like Tucker need these platforms? Or can you go out and create something on your own, whether it's with Rumble or whether it's with your own your own platform or, or, you know, or just kind of um, – you know, you know, doing some deal with Twitter or some, some platform. Um, and, and he's just kind of like, I don't think so. I don't, I don't think you need, I think that's kind of an outdated model. And the idea is yeah. like, whether it's for existing talent or up and coming talent, it's like the old idea was, Oh, I've got to, you know, get to this pinnacle of Fox news, or I got to work at CNN or I got to work at Newsmax. It's like, I, I don't know. I don't know if that's really the case anymore, you know, because there's yeah. so many different ways of communicating with people and reaching your audience. I think that they don't have like the news channels. I don't think have the capability anymore to create big time personalities. And I think, and this is something, this is a point that I'll give a uh, John Ziegler credit. Who's uh, who's great and fantastic reporting about the Penn state scandal. Yeah. Um, but he had made the point that they probably don't want big personalities anymore in truth, because they can't manufacture them. Don Lemon is a perfect yeah. example of that. Don Lemon, they pushed Don Lemon for 17 years and every year his ratings got worse. So you, they clearly, unlike Disney, they can't create stars anymore. Yeah. So it's probably better to have interchangeable talking heads. You don't have to pay a lot that'll tow the company line, whatever you tell them. And then if they don't work out good, you fire them. Or if they yeah. get too big for the britches, you let them move on. Yeah. And yeah, to your point, they don't need, they don't need Fox either. You can you know, develop your own platform if you've got the talent. So yeah, I mean, I, I was looking at some of the numbers and Fox was losing like 50 million a year just on blue chips, blue chip stocks that would not advertise. Yeah on on tucker and i'm just thinking to myself okay so they cut him loose they bring in some milk toast conservative who just you know is like blah 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 toes the company line like you said all of that ad revenue comes back they're going to recoup that money that they lost yeah uh with you know but i you know at i i think i think they're they're probably questioning that maybe now with with the drop off in audience which has been i think like two thirds it's massive it's pretty dramatic yeah, yeah massive it's but, a, but a daily, I think, daily show after john stewart style losses yeah but i i think they want to sell this thing i keep getting the feeling that maybe like cutting him loose cutting bongino loose cutting laura trump loose that not only brings ad revenue back in but it also makes makes it maybe takes the edge out of fox and maybe that makes it a more easier sale they can just get rid of this thing and them and the murdochs are done you know they can mm. go and sit on a beach with a boat drink or something you know well they could do that now let's who are we kidding they can <laughs> they, they can <laughs>